did you just skip the ad? No, no, you don't get off that easily. Um, there's no place like no man's man to me. Dr. Pepper 10 by the sea. I don't, I, okay, yeah, I'll let you off easy this time, but you got lucky. Anyway, um, what am I doing today? Uh, last time we got large march done. See, isn't that awesome? Do I feel like doing another challenge? Yes, but not right now. I'd actually like to beat the game with more characters, and I don't even remember who I beat it with yet. I don't think I beat it as Kane. I, I think I came close, but then he turned into TriQuest at the last minute, and that was just silly. Oh, hey, let's unlock Samson. Uh, unlocked by passing on two treasure rooms and killing Mom. Hmm. I could have sworn I'd done that. Oh, wait, no, I, I, I passed on two treasure rooms and then I died. Okay. Uh, so... Either beat the game as Kane or Maggie. I think I already beat it as Judas. Judas is just that good. But I haven't even played Eve yet, so let's do that. I know, I know she's an advanced player, or advanced character. A character meant for advanced players. And, uh, you know, we'll find out why. Uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and look at the stats. Um, decent speed, decent tears, very low attack, decent range. And she starts with two items, the Dead Bird and the Horror Babylon. <clears throat> Horror Babylon makes it so that when you have one heart left, or less, you go into a powered up state, and uh, you do a lot more damage. Until you, well, you know, until you leave the room after you've healed. Okay, this is going to be tricky. This might be a short run, I mean, I'm, I'm not very good, so... Who knows if... Uh, I gotta get, gotta get the nub before it recharges. Okay, cool. See, that one damage that she starts with is actually kind of a hindrance because it's hard to kill things. Let's go ahead and go to the item room. We're not unlocking Samson just yet. Oh, Max's head. This changes everything. If I remember right, he gives you a lot of attack boost. Let's go ahead and uh, try it. Let's see, one attack, right? Yep. No, I don't want you to die. Nope, nope, nope. And... Max's head, damage up. Uh, the tears, tears haven't really changed colors, but now her damage is two. Okay, maybe it's maybe it's uh, geometric and it doubles up the uh, damage. In which case, it's an excellent thing to get late in the game. But right now, it's just as good as any other damage up, I guess. Well, I will take any damage up you can give me, game. Thank you, thank you so much. As for the other item she starts with, the dead bird, um, that means that whenever Eve gets hit, uh, it'll pop out kind of a familiar, which will attack anything for the rest of the room until you leave. So, you know, this, this Eve character kind of rewards getting hit. I mean, in a way, it's kind of like Lucario from Brawl, you know, my favorite uh, Brawl character, because... I'm not good at that game either, and thus I like I like the fact that the worse I do, the more my opponents need to fear me. So maybe Eve will be just just right for me. I don't know. Let's find out. Two keys. I I can't believe I got that lucky. Oh, and she starts with no coins, no bombs, no keys, and two hearts. So she's she's disadvantaged, and that's why you need to be an advanced player. Though I've heard other people say, you know, they always do great when they're playing Eve or. You know, they need to not play Eve in order to make it interesting. Maybe that will be the case for us, too. I don't really want to go to the shop without any money. I mean, I don't think anything's on sale for zero cents. If it were, I'd be going there all the time just because. Alright. Oh, one penny. That changes everything. I'm going to the store now. Uh, First floor. We haven't done too bad. Didn't even get hit, I don't think. So let's go ahead and fight the boss. Famine. So I'm a little skeptical about uh, skipping the cutscenes. Oh, he does something different. He doesn't summon flies. He like shoots bullets. Whoop! Gotta be on your guard at all times. Though to be honest, this guy is acting pretty easy. The way uh, I don't really need to do much. In fact. Well, actually, the dodging is tough, because he doesn't always shoot in the same pattern. Uh, it's the same six-shot six pattern, but it's not always in the same rotation, I should say. 
Whoa, okay, I, I changed my mind. You're, you're tough. <laughs> Stop hanging out with Monstro. Okay, so, this guy's almost dead. Just, uh, I don't know, eight more hits. And a uh, lot more dodgings. There we go, cool. Didn't take any damage, so I don't really need those hearts, but thank you. Thank you very much. Let's go ahead and go down. Down to the cellar part two, or I won't skip the cutscene, because then the game will um, freeze. Or at least it did that one time, and I regret it. Okay. No bombs. Maybe I'll get lucky and get the epicac again, and then I won't need bombs. Oh, jeez. Okay, this is how Eve... Whoa. Okay, I've got all the keys I can eat now. Boom. So, if you remember, that just means that I don't expend any keys on this floor whenever I uh, use a key, which would be great for here, because, well, yeah. Um, none of you guys are wincing, so I don't really need to be worried about bombs. I think I'll take care of the flies that are after me first. And I win. Okay. So finish this guy off, maybe put out these flames first, and kill the flies. Make sure they dies. I can go to the store for free, let's do it. Um, cheapest thing here is a bomb for three cents. I might get that actually for the chest in the other room. This is starting to be a very interesting run. Cube of meat is guarding me against these foes, but not really. They need to die. Okay, I'll stop. Anyway, I probably should have piled out the fire way earlier, but hey, I like a challenge. My dead bird likes a challenge too. Go get him, boy. We'll put out the fire so they can't be more on fire, even though they can't. And done. Aw, oh, that's just cruel. Hey, would you mind grabbing that penny for me, Mr. Deadbird, since you can fly and all that? Let's try grabbing it from the other And Nope. Okay. That's fine. I don't mind. Really, I don't. Hey, Deadbird, why did you go away? I, I need you again. I need you to stay with me always. Okay, item room. Something good? So, we got the mini mush. Let's go ahead and pick that. Oh. I can buy that bomb now, if I don't find any more bombs. Oh, I can buy not a second bomb, but something that costs four cents. Alright, speed and range. I like range, and I like speed. You gotta be dodgy as Eve. Especially when she goes into her powered up state, because she's actually kind of slower in that state. Well, not just her, but anybody. Um, it's not just Eve who can get the horror bad one, you know. I got it on Isaac maybe Judas earlier somebody so we'll go ahead and kill him get a half a heart we don't have a use for and I'm just getting keys all over the place let's go ahead and go grab that bomb hmm hmm how do I want to do this yeah We'll worry about the sacrifice room uh, after I beat the boss. Alright, thanks to the bomb. And... Actually, the boss might give us something good, and we're not going to get more health than what we have right now, barring what's in the chest, which could be like a super troll bomb that'll just kill me. So let's go ahead and fight the boss. Larry Jr. Okay, we, we can handle him, I think. He's not out of my area of expertise. And this is a lot easier to shoot now that the uh, stacks of rocks are not staggered. So I can just sit down here and shoot him from up here, or from down here. Okay, that's one down. Larry Jr. He's one of those guys that you can take for granted that he's so easy, but then one day he just, you know, completely changes on you. And he's like much faster and takes the turns that you don't expect him to take and then oh you take you're taking damage all right we might as well go see what's in the devil room <clears throat> didn't take any damage here did take damage on this floor though all right uh i feel like taking the dead cat just because i have so little health as it is 
and it only cost me one heart container when you think about it. So that was that was worth it. I don't I don't mind that trade at all. Well, uh, actually, I somewhat do. It's going to make that sacrifice room impossible to take. I'm probably going to die a couple times just going to the spiked hallway room, but you know, let's do it anyway. And hopefully, there's something worthwhile in here. Uh, thanks. That that wasn't too bad. Uh, however, yeah, I definitely can't use the sacrifice room, and you know, frankly, I don't think I want to. Let's go ahead and blow this up. I'm trying to think if there's an optimum way of doing this. There wouldn't be a way to do this without uh, with trying to get this wall while we're at it. So we'll just blow that up. Uh, speed up. Yeah, you know, I like getting passive items out of those chests. That's totally worth it. Was there anything? Oh uh, yeah, just the sacrifice room. Well, let's play it once. I think it takes an entire heart. Yep, it does. Was it worth a life? Yes. It might have a bomb in it. Uh, not that kind of bomb. Alright, so... Now that we've seen me be stupid once already and waste a spirit heart, let's go down before I shame myself some more. Not a bad run for a character I've never played as before, so... Yes. And I, I guess I just stepped on it twice because I saw it only take one half of a spirit heart, but it took an entire regular heart, so I, I don't know what to say about that. Yeah. Alright. <clears throat> Back to business. The catacombs or the caves. It's, you know, the alternative to the caves, I guess. Now, I gotta remember that I don't have that golden key anymore. I mean, otherwise, after you got the golden key, you wouldn't care anymore about keys at all. Oh, died again. And all those guys are gonna be back. Uh, but the rocks aren't, so, you know, advantage me. Alright, keep your distance, Captain. Keep your far distance. Okay, that guy shot, so that means the other guys are ready to shoot. I noticed that they have something of a timer, or at least it certainly seems like a timer. And keep your distance, because if they have a very short explosive range, then the explosive just goes fly, boom, explode instantly rather than taking its time, and you can't, you don't have any time to dodge it. And that guy was about to shoot. Alright. And done. Probably should have used them to blow up this wall, but at this point, I, I don't have that kind of luxury. The rosary, uh, that's a lot of spirit hearts. Let's do it. It's not like I'm going to leave it or anything. I just had to think about how I was going to do that. Okay. So. Um, lucky dodges all around. And these spiders are not lucky. Alright, a bomb! Just what I wanted, okay. So far we're getting a feel for this map. Hmm. I gotta blow up one of these guys by the walls here. Okay, not there. Well, I mean, yes there, but... None of them wanted to die. Oh, oh, I called it. Okay, let's go ahead and go in there. For free. Uh, spiders. You know, these super secret rooms sure are hard to find but they don't like being rewarding um do I want to explore the rest of this floor slightly I, I want to see what's in the super secret room or I mean in the regular secret room hey shoot a bomb over here okay shoot a bomb over here do it mostly not because I want to blow up the wall but because if he, if he hits me right here, or hits this location, I should say, I should hope I won't be here when he does, then... Oh, wait, that won't work. Oh, well, I blew up the wall. That's half of what I wanted, but... Yeah, I knew something was going to spawn in the middle there. Anyway... Free money. Uh, we'll go into the secret... Or this... This room over here, after we put out these fires. At this point, I need all the advantages I can get. Um, Guppy's head. Now I've got two Guppy's heads. This is. Now I don't even know what to make of that. Oh hey, hey hey hey, blow up this uh, chest over here. Yeah, yeah. You're my buddy. You're my friend. 
and now sadly you passed away. Okay. That was worth it. Darn you bomb for being out of range. Darn you green he greed heads for existing. Um, at least I have tons of speed both from my shots and from my dodges. Too bad I'm so terrible at aiming. However, the thing about aiming in this game is that it's also about moving. So it's not like you can aim and shoot all the time. It's... Yeah. I don't know where I was going with that. <clears throat> Found the store. And, you know, let's go ahead and use Guppy's head because it, it recharges once a room, I believe. Ooh, one bomb for two? I think I'll do that. I just gotta be careful that my friends don't push the bomb out of the way. And they didn't. Money, money, money. You know, the shop is totally a doable thing now. Ooh, the map. That'll speed things along slightly. And it's on half price. Don't mind if I do. I think I'll save the rest of my money, though. I don't need keys. Whoops. I do need bombs now. Alright, um... No, I'm not doing that anymore. I think it's going to be my thing where I'm not going to use those sacrifice rooms anymore, because they're just not worth it. They cost a lot of health. They're worse than a blood bank, if you ask me. But then again, there's probably some item that you can only get from there, so who knows. Oh, gonna need to, gonna get another cube of meat. Okay, just gotta dodge this guy as best we can. Dodge these things as best we can. Guess what? You hit me, pal, so you get to deal with my dead bird. Alright, just stay away from this guy when he launches bombs. I mean, he can hurt his friends, but he can't hurt himself. So he has every, every incentive to use it. Yeah, go dead bird, go. Okay. I'll just shoot him from afar, watch for the bombs, dodge even if I don't think they're coming to me, and get our meat boy. Woo! Okay. Anything I'm forgetting here? No? Alright, then let's go on down. I think my meat head is larger than I am. Okay. Once again, not skipping the movies because it freezes the game occasionally when I do that. Yes, I'm aware that only happened once, but it only has to happen once. Okay, uh, that penny is going to have to stay there forever. Forever, forever, no matter how long. Okay, and then we'll go ahead and take these guys out. They're closing in. But, you know, I'm just so smart. Whoop, almost ate my words there. Oh, the flat penny. I think I remember that doing something great. Uh, let's circle around the other way and see if there's any bombers that can blow up the secret room wall for me. Yeah, you guys should have been one room down below, please. In fact, blow up that wall. Okay, no? Alright, then I'll just kill you. Thank you, though. Oh, and before you die, could you put some of your explosive vomit into a Ziploc bag for me to use? Because I could really use bombs. Seriously. Alright. Oh. Um, picking up that penny made the, the thing do something. Thanks, dead bird. Finish him. Okay. Now, rather than rushing at these guys, let's just blow them up from afar. Sweet. Okay, these TNT barrels were not nearly close enough to blow up the walls, but the bomb is. Boom. Don't shoot the bomb. Hmm. We'll play it three times. With the bomb. Okay, so that's once. Twice. Three times a gamblings. Hmm, a dime. That was totally worth it. Okay, we'll we'll not we'll not do this much more because and I might as well get this key. The flat penny appears to be making keys drop whenever I pick up money, which is totally cool. And do I want to go into that spiked hallway? 
Well, first, let's see. How do I? How do we get in there? I think it's going to take two bombs, but as you can plainly see, there's three bombs in there, so it's totally worth it to do this. Okay, cool. Uh, let's do it. Oh, friends till the end, you know. Something I should be using with all my guppy heads uses. Alright, so I have the map. I just don't know where anything is. Which means the boss might be up here. Or it might not. And you know what? I don't need keys so badly to trade a bomb for them. Whoop, 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 whoop. I'm one hit from death. But... Since I am Eve, it's not... Or, since I have the the dead cat thing it's not that bad and as soon as you guys damage me guess what I'm gonna power up yet again now here's the question what kind of class is Eve I mean she doesn't have a whole lot of damage she she's got decent speed and she's got low health I just don't know might be like a summoner or something all right guppy's head help me out here might as well save our money for the next store, which will be full of greed. So it goes. Alright. Right or down? Down. I want the item room. Items. Okay. Uh, there's no chance the super secret room is here, so we'll just not even mess with these guys. And we'll use Guppy's head again because I keep forgetting to do that. Get him. Get him. Alright. Ah, dang it. That's the worst timing in history. Oh well. I'm getting rid of Larry Jr. And I'm getting rid of Larry Jr. wannabe. I don't even know what to call those things. I think they're harder than Larry Jr. though. Let's be honest. And done. Hearts I don't need, thanks. Ah, the Spelunker's hat. Now I can totally see where the super secret room is. Because the map doesn't tell me that sort of information. And then that's the boss room. Uh, Let's go look for the super secret room in the rooms I've already been real quick. Because there's no enemies in there. Nope, not there. Maybe in the bottom left wing. I know I'd, I'd like to speed these up, but since I'm Eve and I've only got one health, and I'm not a very good player, I need every advantage I can get. The ironic thing about that is that the more rooms I explore, the more deaths I'm probably going to incur, and this is just going to get worse. Okay. Greed heads, leave me alone. Oh, powered up. At least I have a chance of taking these guys out. Somewhat. And you know what? You guys just technically gave me keys by making me drop coins, so congratulations. That's some advanced Isaac play. That someone else thought of years ago. And I got my health back. Do I want to take it, though? Yeah, I do. As much like being in the powered up state. Okay, I, I gotta take out these guys as fast as I can. Now, if I could just throw a bomb over there and make that middle rock here scooch over, that would do it in one bomb, but I I don't have the ability to throw bombs, so... Alright, you want to be a little higher on the rock bombing, so... Yeah, like here. And then we'll do this. Boom! Yes, I'm aware that one bomb made that do that, but I could only do that on this little place here, and that wasn't existing back then, so, nah. Let's go ahead and blow this up. And go in. Okay, I could use spirit hearts. Let's go ahead and use Guppy's head while we're at it. Um... We'll think about that one. I, I, I don't think the tick is actually a bad thing, just it has a special thing where you can't drop it. Hmm. Let's keep playing this. I like... I like spirit hearts. I need more of them. 
and we'll play until we get down to seven cents. Question is, do we blow it up? Maybe. Yeah, I'm thinking about blowing it up. Alright, the sun. Lots of damage, and it heals me, which would mean something if I wasn't Eve. Uh, Flat Penny, you're making me lots of keys, but seven keys is enough. However, I think I could get a better thing than the tick, so you get to stay on board. Congrats. Alright, there's absolutely no reason to go into the other room, so we'll just go ahead and uh, beat the boss and go down. And if it's a boss with a whole bunch of segments, like, I don't know, Fistula? Oh, jeez. I might have to use the sun on this guy just to beat him. Okay. Friends till the end. Go! Alright. He took... It, touching me took off a whole heart. I didn't appreciate that. I might as well just let Dead Bird take care of things from a distance. Alright. I was wondering when he was finally going to do that. Uh, let's take out one of them as fast as we can. Oh. Let's go ahead and use the sun. Oh, jeez, this is tough. Okay. Uh, where did my dead bird go? Seriously. Okay, sweet. And I get another follower. Awesome, okay. Let's leave that whole heart there for the next Isaac comes along. Oh, but there's stuff up there. Hmm. I think I want to do that, especially since one of them's the boss challenge room and I get a item out of that. Let's do it. And this will be a longer video, I'm sorry. I apologize, but this is just too much fun. Um, friends to the end, go. Okay, so I think I think I'm winning here. It's hard to tell when none of them are dead. Well, okay, half of them are dead now, but and these flies, I tell ya. Flies these days. Okay. Done and done. More health for the um health thingy. Hey, guys, blow this up for me. Thank you. And I don't need them to bomb anything else, so I'll just take them out. Okay, that's one. Hey, that's my chest. Stay away from that. No, I don't think they can actually get into your chest or anything, so... Okay, question. Do I want to f go to the arcade first or the boss challenger? Boss challenger. Range up. How far can I shoot? I can already hit the end of the thing. And I've only got three range. But maybe I'll get somebody else when they all die. And besides, I like the challenge. Okay, friends till the end. And Monster's head is going down quick enough. I don't think I need to worry. I just can't let him touch me. I think he does a whole heart of damage if he actually touches you rather than just shooting you. So... Yeah. I'm earning this range up. Hey, Larry Juniors. Now, I could use a well-placed bomb and miss all three of these guys, but then I'd miss all three of these guys. Okay. I'm glad that they made the, uh, the Spelunker's helmet able to see the super secret room. That's actually pretty handy. Go ahead and use Friends Till the End yet again, because, I mean, why not? Oh, boy, an Eternal Heart. Uh, we'll see about that. I mean, I, I need to pick that up later. Okay, I got a penny. Let's go ahead and play these guys for... Actually, I don't really want to play them for health. I've got plenty of health scattered around. And I don't want to get killed by this fly. So let's go grab health from back here. Half hearts first. I don't know why, but I just want to do it that way. Okay, we're going to see that message a lot, I think. Okay. And we'll do that again. Let's see, where else did I leave some hearts? Over here? Yes. 
Alright, and then she goes back to normal. That helmet has to be breaking from all the stress of constantly warping head. Okay, let's do this again. Okay, that's not exactly what I wanted, actually. But let's pick it up anyway, and then drop it. Actually, wait. We'll take it with us, and we will come back for the guppy's head, because that's just plain awesome. Let's be honest. But we will grab the hearts over here, and use them, and then use the blood bank. Oh, let me get this cursor off. And then... Yeah, so I'm getting like free money. I don't think I can possibly get um, the blood bag from this this portable blood bank that I have, but still, it's worth it, right? Of course it is. All right, so now we're gonna go back and we're gonna exchange this blood bag for the thing after we grab that heart and we'll pick up that eternal heart while we're at it and we'll pick that up and we'll play these guys until we get down to seven cents I didn't even see what he has on offer apparently a lit bomb way to go and uh... free keys okay two more times on this thing I, I don't want to get below eight cents Okay, that's supposed to be a pretty fly. Okay, whatever. Actually, wait. I have a present for you. It's a bomb. Enjoy. Oh. Umbilical cord. Let's find out what that does. It doesn't go in my collection, so I don't, I don't think I need a, a real reason to be collecting all of the trinkets. That's what they're called. However, let's do it anyway. And find out what each and every one of them does, because... Did I leave anything in here? It's hard to tell with this crown. Okay, no I didn't. And we'll go... Down. And get another heart container. However, if I die, I will lose that extra heart container. That's the curse of the nine lives. Sadly. Okay. Now, let's go up, I think. You... Whoa. What's up there, guys? Ah, dang it. Okay, so here's how I'm going to do it. Put a bomb here, shoot it over. Totally miss. Uh, we'll save the last bomb just in case. Hey, Greed, what's up? And I mostly went in here because I've got tons of keys anyway. Alright, dead bird, get him. Get him good. Thank you, dead bird. Alright, and should be done. Probably gonna get... Oh, matchstick. Um, oh, that's right, I don't have a flat penny anymore, so I'm not gonna get tons of keys, but I don't need tons of keys. I'm still trying to figure out what this umbilical cord does. And I don't want to blow that up, so... Uh... A key for that that thing. These guys sure are interesting. Whoa. Okay, I'm glad I have enough dodge juice to pull that off. Alright, fistulas. Fistu oh ouch. There went my heart container. Thanks a lot, explosive turret guy. Jerk. Annoying thing about him is that he actually aims for me. So it's harder to dodge. I don't know. Okay. I wonder if each of these deaths count as a death in my stats. Because if they do, that's actually kind of a good thing. Oh boy. Oh boy. Um, because I need to get 100 deaths in order to unlock a certain item. Spoiler alert. So, I kind of wish I had that poo helmet right now. Keep the flies away. Oh well, what can you do? Oh hey, there's a bomb fly. Let's try and blow it up when it's most north. Um, hey there, guy. 
And I guess we'll just take this guy out while we're at it. Okay, shooting flies. No. Bad. Okay, watch its trajectory. Not even nearly close enough yet. Oh, now there's two of them. And now that I've killed both those fly spawners, there won't be any more, so I gotta do this right the first time. However, I think I might have them in just the wrong trajectory that they'll never hit the north wall again unless I destroy one of them. So let's do that. Okay, actually they're not hitting each other anymore, so let's let's watch. There we go, got it, okay. Excellent. And I somehow mistakenly got that too. I'm just accidentally awesome, I guess. Okay. Uh, yeah, I could have grabbed that, but let's come back later for it. Dang it. Wish I still had... Oops. Well, I've got more keys than I know what to do with, so I don't really mind. Okay, cool. Down or left. Let's go down. You know, there sure are a lot of blowing up things on this floor. Wow. Somehow dodging everything. Somehow. Hey, dead bird, I don't think you can kill that guy, so... I wouldn't bother if I were you. However, you are doing an excellent job of preventing him from shooting, so I don't know. Good job. Here's my thumbs up to you. Uh, no need to have these guys blow anything up except each other, and they can't do that, so let's, let's ignore them. And by ignore them, I mean destroy them. I expect a blackened floor by, by the time this is all done. Okay, cool, cool, cool. And, whoop, whole heart of damage if they get me. But guess what? They didn't get me. Now to eat these fistulas. Not literally. I, I wouldn't recommend eating fistulas. I don't even know what those actually are. Okay. You know, one thing I'd actually like about now is flight. Get him. I don't need a key that bad. Oh no, my nemesis. I think they do a whole heart of damage while they're at it. Okay. So, I just need to take him out. Quickly. Alright. You know, one thing I would change about these guys is that when you hit a heart, I'd like the mask to flash too, so you know which one is which. Might make it a little more strategic. I don't know. Now, do I worry about taking this pill when I only have one heart container? No. I think the health down turns into a health up when you only have one. But the range down can hit you all the same. Uh, we haven't gotten to the item room yet. And frankly, right now, I'm, I'm not as good as I can be against the boss. So we'll go ahead and explore until we get to the item room. Dodge everything all the way across the sky. Okay, I'll stop. That, that mem, that meme is old. Why did I pronounce it mem? Because I kind of figured it came from the French word mem, which means same. And, you know, when everyone does the same thing, it's a mem. Whoop. Alright, get rid of them. Okay, who's who's shooting homing tears? Oh. Um, I have Steven, little Stevie, with me now. Cool, but I, I don't remember ever getting you. Um, thanks for joining. Seriously, did I pick him up somewhere? And, well, now he's gone. Maybe Steve just comes to the rescue occasion. I don't know. The hourglass. Well, let's use Guppy's head one last time. And then we'll use the hourglass. This thing is kind of like Mom's bra, but... Yeah, it, it's pretty much like Mom's bra. Okay. I want these guys to blow up this wall for me. And then I'll take out all these nubs in one shot. Well, three shots. How many that took. And before we leave, let's go in the secret room. Unk! Yet another life. So, I don't want to die this time, or I'll come back as TriQuest. And, 
Yeah, that messed up my cane run. Um, no reason to go into that spiked chamber. But there is a reason to blow this up. Boom! Shaka Waka. Uh, the Crystal Skull. I think that just warps me out of the room if I get close to death. Which is actually pretty fantastic, but not for Eve, because she actually wants to be close to death. Forgot about this poop. Alright. What? What room is that? All the way up there at the top. I, I don't remember going there. Oh. No, I, I still don't know what that is. Okay. It's a new icon. That's what it is. Uh, let's go ahead and uh, find the store. Because I, I don't see a store icon. Hey guys. Bye guys. Whoop. Now I'm so close to death. And Steven's with me again. Hey Steven. Lil Stevie. Lil Steve. Whatever you want to be called. Let's see. Got you. Got you too. Troll Bomb will take care of my dirty work for me. And let's go ahead and open this. Uh, I need more heart containers or something. Wow, I can't believe I dodged that. Okay, I think the secret is these guys will follow or chase or whatever you want to call that. Oh, now I'm, uh, I think I'm, uh, TriQuest now. So, there's almost no point in beating it with him. Seriously. You got dead cat, don't pick up the onk, I guess. We'll see. I, I need to beat a floor and find out. And by there's no point in beating him with it, I mean I'm not going to get a different ending. Hey, a free book. Hmm. Yeah, let's take the book of Bilal. Let's show them a thing or two about damage. And let's go beat the boss. And then we'll see in the movie if we are TriQuest, the dead body guy. You know him. And through here. The bloat. Go ahead and start off by using this. And I think we're always in uh, awesome mode, so you know we don't need to worry about that so much. Okay, so instead of peep and I presume. We got the bloat and blood. That's horrendous. Especially since it, the darn creep lasts so long. Okay, enough of that. Now if I remember right, it can shoot any direction but up. So let's take it out from up. Dead bird, take care of it. Okay. I keep thinking it's going to hop toward me, so I, I come down and take it. Uh, let's go ahead and grab all these spirit hearts. And we'll see what the devil wants. Uh, uh, um, more damage or more everything? More damage. So much more damage. Let's have a look at how much our damage is. Our damage is maxed. And we got the Book of Bilal, so this is going to be, yep, I'm TriQuest. But I've come so far already, let's let's just beat it anyway. Uh, I'll be just looking for the boss as fast as I can. This would be a Book of Bilal room, but guess what, I don't have that ready, so whatever. <sighs> Darn you, Onk, and your TriQuest things. And your ability to cr cause me to be TriQuest. Okay, I gotta pick a wing. It could be down either one of these. Well, guess what? I found the secret room, so... Nah. And I want to take out that bomb fly while I was next to that other spawner, but this will work. Actually, this will work fantastically if I can get him to come down right here. 
So now we just wait and wait and wait. I'm seeing a pattern here. Yeah, I'll just do it myself. Okay. Bomb right here. Secret room right there. And I go in and I win. Okay, I definitely want to find the store now. I can buy two 15 centers. Whatever those would be. Gamble, bottle, pop. Gamble, bottle, pop. And just dodge everything. And take them out. Done. Um, not sure what that does. A missing page. Cool. Don't mind if I do. Um, sorry, I'm Bill Court. I still have no idea what you do. Uh, no real reason to do any of these things. I just came in for that free coin. It's not always there, I should say, but, you know, when it is, take it. Uh, item room. Don't mind if I do. Tarot cards. I might as well make one for free. Okay. Got it. Uh, the sun. That's that's a pretty good card. It's like death plus the world plus healing plus, well, everything. However, I, I can't use the healing portion, so whatever. I might just use it here. Or I might use it against mom. I don't, I don't know. We'll, we'll think about it. And you're done. He's just a bomb fly. Bombing all over the place. Another spirit heart. Ah, boss challenge room. I love these things. Milk. Uh, this is a lot more bosses than I was told would be in the newspaper. So, I'm going to demand extra compensation. Okay, I've already expended that breakfast I got, so this so far has not been worth it. Hey, Peep, stop being my nemesis. You're actually kind of easy. Alright. I hope these are the only two bosses. Let's go ahead and use the sun. Take these two out. And Peep, he should be he should have been dead a long time ago. Pow. Oh, and there I go. Okay. There's Wow, that's messed up. Um, I've got a spirit heart, or I mean, I've got a, a heart container now. And the music's going on, so maybe I need to take care of this. Okay, no I don't. Actually, wait. What happens if I pause it? Nope. Okay. I win, I guess. So now I, I really do look like TriQuest, but... I've got a heart container. I don't know what to say about that. Okay. Okay, let's go find the store. Hopefully I can buy a hard container there. And nubs. Scrubbity nubbity nubs. Just take them on out. And... Man, they shoot fast. I don't know, maybe the FPS just glitched out or something. I seem to be going faster too. Okay. So we'll take this guy out as fast as we can. And there we go. Now we got a free bomb fly to just bomb around and bomb fly whatever a bomb fly bombs. Try saying that eight times fast. Okay, I'm going to take out the bomb fly because I've only got one hit on me. And done. Now this guy. This guy. This guy right here. And take out the shooting flies. Take out the... Oh, oh, not the bomb fly. Not when he's this close. And there's no... Nothing in here, so we'll just... Yeah, go in here. Bible? Hmm, maybe. Spirit Heart. That sounds like an idea. This is the very last store, so I might as well buy everything, actually. Except for the, uh... Bible. Might come back for that if I really need to fly for our room. Or two. And now let's just go fight the boss, I guess. Oh, dodged. Oh, you killed your friend. Oh, too bad for you. 
Oh, gotta dodge everything. Okay, I'm, I'm amazed I didn't get hit there. And uh, I'll, I'll see about picking up that heart later. Blood bank gambling is nice, especially now that I have only one heart container, but it takes a lot of time. Uh, I want to save my book of Belial for the boss. And I'm having second thoughts. Dang, these bombs in there always do one heart worth of damage ways. Okay. Uh, let's just use it. Okay, I'm, I've turned back to Eve. This run is salvageable again. Cool. Maybe. I don't know. I've got Eve's head, kind of, but TriQuest's body. We'll, we'll see what it shows in the movie. Oh, more fodder for the blood bank. This is a problem. Dang it. Okay, now I'm gonna go play the blood bank. Hopefully I can get another heart container, because if I can, uh, that might just save this run. Maybe. Alright, I don't have any use for my so I might as well get all I can from here. Spirit Heart, that was worth it so far. One thing I hate about gambling is that when you lose, you can't control your character as they go, Oh, I lost, you know, for a split second. And when he s shoots out a fly at you, that's, uh, that's a bad thing. Because I don't have time to shoot. Another Spirit Heart. Yay! Must think I'm a tri quest, and so it's just giving me spirit hearts. Okay, more money to gamble with, thanks. Uh, Pooh Helmet. Not as helpful as it was earlier, but. Oh, well, I didn't need it anyway, so meh. Okay, I want this heart. Alright, sweet. Now just take this, gamble here. Grab that, and grab this, gamble with that. Alright, cool. Got more gambling juice. And, nope, no such luck. Uh, I'm out of money. Well, I'm not out of hearts, though. And we'll think about that one. I don't want to blow it up just yet. Okay. Go ahead and grab this heart. We can gamble with that now. I really want an extra heart container because being one shot it just isn't my style. It really isn't. Okay. A couple more gambling juices. I'm gonna use this guy. Hopefully. Oh, more spirit hearts. Okay, that was that was totally worth it. Thanks. And the key. Oh, guess what? I didn't want your key, so meh. Okay. You know, things as they are right now, I think will just work. I don't really need that extra heart container now. As much as as nice as it would be. Okay, just take out the nubs. Take out the nubs as fast as you can. Let's go kill the sub boss. Pride! First time I've seen him in this in my runs. Okay, the tricky part is when he spawns bombs all over the place. And the extra tricky part is how the bombs. Oh! Book of Sins. Probably for killing all of them. Anarchist Cookbook. Don't need it. Actually, I do. I do need it. You know why? I'll show you why. I'll show you why. Okay, we're going back to Gamble's McGamble Scorch. Actually, we're going to grab this heart. And then we'll gamble one last time. And if they don't act up, or if they don't, if the blood bank doesn't do what I want it to, 
it's going to get an anarchist cookbook to the face. So let's uh, let's try this one more time. Uh, whoops. Did that use a spirit heart? Yeah, it did. Well, now I've got some money to gamble with, so I don't know. I'll do that in a bit. Thank you. Uh, way more gambling juice. It's gonna take a while, folks. Uh, I could've used those hearts. Really, I could've... Um, range down? Yeah, no thanks. I, I said I don't want it. Seriously. Okay. Gamble. Gamble. Gamble, gamble. Okay, I really want that heart. I think I saw it. Nope. I'm starting to think this is just completely random. Not because I'm a sore loser or anything, but because I could have sworn I saw it go into the right hand and it was not there. Okay. I'm not even watching anymore. I'm just presuming it's random. Oh, well, I'm going to blow up that rock and shoot a bomb across the room. Hope you're proud of yourself. Okay. Hmm. More money. More money. Was that a heart? I want that heart. Gimme. Yay, heart. Okay, cool. Ah, it's gonna take forever. Alright, Pooh Helmet, I can I can handle that. Well guess what? You all just got to set up the bomb. So did I actually. Okay, lots of stuff. Particularly gambling juice. Now hopefully the other blood bank realizes that I'm serious about this. Oh please be something good. Speed down well actually that's not so bad. I'm not good enough to have all this speed. Let's gamble this one once. Money. Okay. And we'll go grab this heart and gamble it one more time because I don't really need full health, especially since I'm getting damage up. And then we'll blow it up. Done. Another spirit heart. Awesome. Okay, so none of the blood banks realized I was serious, and they both paid for it with their lives. What have we learned, other blood banks? Not to give Captain Thief money. No, no, that's not the lesson that we learned here. Whatever. Um, oh, right, I don't want this anarchist cookbook anymore. I mean, it's good. Just not as good as Book of Bilal. I'm like a, a Judas Cain right now. Uh, and now we go through. Okay. Oh boy. Still saving my uh, item usage for the boss, though. So, whatever. Massive amounts of whatever. And done. Extra key I don't need. Thank you. Oh yeah, you. Okay, so far so good, I think. Okay, you don't want to walk into the eye because then a hand can come out of there and hit you. Not something you want, usually. Alright, so, just take out mom like we usually do. And, oh, a Winsor. Ah, I was worried about the Winsor's bomb, so I took some silly damage and took some more lame damage but at least I have homing shots you can't take those away from me jeez I heard you the first time ah a health up yay okay now I won't wow you're kinda messed up looking there Eve or yep it's Eve so I can beat the game and it will count as Eve I think I don't even know We'll, we'll even see if I can beat the game, to be honest. I, I still look like TriQuest, but whatever. 
Okay, how do we... How do we get this guy? I think key to my beating him was the faster shots that I have. Hello, Tooth Wind Socks. And... Dang it. These guys have a lot more health than I thought they would. So I'll just uh, not even pretend that I'm about to kill them occasionally. Like I tend to do. What's in here? Worth it. Not worth it. Help me. Well, that's just a boss challenge room. Let's go ahead and use this. And we're winning. And done. But I, I think I have three waves, so it's not like I'm, this is going to be easy or anything. Hey, Chubbs. Hey, Chublets. I was lucky to get that Chublet killed on my way over. And now, we're working on this Chub. He, did he just eat his friend on purpose? Does he get health for doing that? Because if he does, that's kind of messed up. Okay. You're done, Chubby. And third one. Oh, double monstros. I bet you thought I was going to say all the way across the sky, didn't you? Well, guess what? I didn't. Okay. Now, as much as I'd like to work on one monster at a time, and that's kind of what I'm doing, it's a little hard when they shuffle around like that. So, you know, I'll just take them out. I'll just take out the monstro. Kill the monstro you're with, basically. And done. Yay, a bomb. Not as necessary as earlier. Uh, sh let's go to the secret room. There's no item shops here, or item rooms even, so it's not as imperative to explore everything. In fact, it's probably a bad thing to try and do that. But, ah, okay. Let's take out the wall climber, because he's a jerk. And I think I took out the uh, veteran. What are these? Tapeworms? Ringworms? Some terrible parasite? The Joker. Takes us to the devil room, I think. That's cool. Oh boy. Eyeballs. My true nemesis. No matter what those masks think. Okay, just gotta. Okay, that was that was some fancy dodging there, but I actually did it by accident. I got lucky. Secret room. Money, right? No, nope, it's greed. You know what? I don't need money, so buy greed. Okay. Where am I going? Oh, we'll just go down. You know, what? let's use this Joker card. Who oh boy. I don't want either of those things. I'll just turn it into TriQuest again. <laughs> again. Uh, I do something that, that rarely happens, and I, I act like it's something that just happens all the time. Hmm. If I can just walk him on the spikes without walking on the spikes myself, I could totally Shikamaru this guy, but... Okay, I'm not going in there. That, the boss couldn't possibly be in there. It would tell me. That's how I know. Okay, dead bird, I, I took some pain summoning you, so please do your job. What job is that? I, I don't know, but do it. Kill these enemies. Okay, please, please be a health up. Why? Okay, um, one hit from death. No, it, it's fine. Let's go ahead and book a blow this place. I, I want to take out these ringworms as fast as possible. And... Yeah. Health down. Oh, why did I even go in here? Oh, because... Please be health up. Okay, whatever. I'll, I'll just unlock both of them. Um... Sheesh. Oh, why did I go in here? 
well, the super secret room's in here. And this will give me some practice fighting these guys. You know what? I'm just going to go in there, blow up the secret room. Whoops. And go in there, see what's in there. Bunch of hearts I don't have a use for. Okay, now I want that door bombed open. I'm probably going to lose it here, guys. Not, you know, get angry or anything, but just die, you know? That thing. Okay, I've only got one life left. Had plenty earlier. That super secret room was not worth going to. Hopefully the boss is over here. Guess what? It isn't. And there it goes, okay. Well, that there goes my first Eve run. Uh, don't know what to say about that. <laughs> Still bouncing around back there. Uh, psh, I did good enough, I guess. Um, thanks for watching. This has been Captain Thief. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.